2.9 million. Exactly. 2.9 million. That's how much Apple spent last year through the third quarter on lobbying in Washington. 2.9 million dollars in lobbying. That's a lot of lobbying. Yeah, it is a lot of lobbying, but it's not as much as Google, which was nearly 14 million that period. But it is on pace for a new record for Apple, which is just underscoring how much more of a presence they're having in the city. And back in the day, Steve Jobs, the company, did some lobbying, but really kept government, like a lot of Silicon Valley, sort of at arm's length. Yeah, under Tim Cook, that's changing. He's making an effort to get uh, Apple out uh, in the community in D.C. They're the world's largest company now, and they have a lot more issues as they. Get Get into new product lineups such as smartwatch and and health data. Well, the Apple Health thing has you know taken off in the way that the the the, uh, the hype might have suggested at least in the first few months. Well, we could see some changes when the new watch comes later this year. Uh, when do you think it's going to happen? What's your guess? March you're ready. Uh, Marchish. But you're more ready in March. Yeah. Uh, they what did they say? They they said it would be first the beginning of the year. Then they said first half. Yeah. Yeah. In my experience, first half is June 30, because nothing happens until the deadline. Uh, there's a, Excitement is building, you can tell that. And, and it, 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 do you think health is the main focus of this lobbying effort, or are there other big issues as well? It's, it's a variety of issues. It used to be they'd only do maybe six agencies. Now they're doing more than 13, which just is underscoring how much more of a presence. They're going to the FTC, for example, talking to them about data and privacy and that sort of thing. A meeting with lawmakers on the Hill in private, you kind of showing them the devices that, and, and just being out there more, being more proactive. It's fairly interesting uh, because it's you know these issues of technology are floating into everything, including politics. Yeah.